Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? Real Diversity here. We are back. Um, we're today we're using a Tyranitar deck. I last, if you guys seen any of my other recent videos, I had made a video on a Tyranitar EX deck. Um, I, it, I made it, it was like kind of my own deal that I was trying to make, and it, it just didn't work too well. So I ended up looking into some, I was trying, I really just wanted to get a good skeleton. Um, for another uh, Tyranitar for this Tyranitar deck, so I ran across this one. Uh, this is was like from a Japanese deck. Um, but here, this is these are the uh, Pokemon. So you know, pause that if you need to see that again. Here are the items. Um, I got a few new items I haven't even ever used before. Um, and like this letter of engagement. Um, I don't ever use the Pal Pad. Um, but this is here. Um, and Netball. Uh, what is this Chris uh, Cheryl and Cheryl's I have yet to really like have success with this card but this is a really good card to clear Tyranitar of a lot of damage and Tyranitar can immediately do like he can immediately do some damage just by adding one by adding just one um energy to him so this is i can see the use in that just having a lot of these it's just like everything has to line up right and i'm still learning the deck so the energy there is eight fighting one water and then one luminous energy which i never understood why not just have two luminous energies unless that's against the rules let me see i'm not sure if having two is bad I don't. I know I don't own two, but I always, you know, that might be one adjustment I could make is have two of those instead. Because then, I, I mean, you don't really lose anything if you have to play that um, on like Tyranitar or something. So instead of like throwing that water on Tyranitar, so yeah, that's my assumption on that. Uh, but it, sometimes it can be hard to get energy out. There is no energy search. Um, and yeah, so you either just kind of look up and get your water energy or you don't, which is another thing I'm not a big fan of. So you need Swamper really for a, uh, for his earthquake. Um, but if you can't really set up, if you can't really get that water to set up earthquake, which takes three energies, um, yeah, you're, in, you're in big trouble. So there's a lot of flaws to this deck. Um, I think the biggest one really is you just want. You want something to get knocked out almost is like the only way anything really happens here. And that's from, and, and that just depends on the cards you have in your hand. So anyways, this is the deck we're going to try it out. Not my original deck. I was a, I believe a Japanese, um, um, player made this, uh, but so far I've tried it twice now. I don't think I've won either games, um, but still learning the deck. And I think it's just might meet, need to be some adjustments made. I try decks like this. I try not to touch like too much. Like if there's like a if there's a um, standard like battle deck for like um, like the Charizard one, the Charizard EX, like I, the Toad Screw deck, right? The Toad Screw EX. Like I'll I'll adjust those decks because they're like the basic like versions of those are very um, they're just not that great. So we go first here. This is a deck that doesn't mind either. Um, we're gonna have to redraw here. Hopefully we get another. Oh, maybe or maybe not. Oh, we did have a. Okay, good. And we looked up and get finally got a battle pass VIP. I normally never like seeing these, but these are these are better than having Clavel, I guess. Forties. Because if you if you have Clavel, then you have to play Clavel turn. To, or get lucky and have him for turn two. If we get lucky, we'll pull another one, which we did not, but that's fine. We did get our luminous energy, so we can probably go straight into. Um, let me see. We don't have a B. Yeah, we have B Burl already. That's good. Yeah, we're in a good shape here early.
funny enough, too, we should be able to... We should be able to play Torrent our next turn if we use Ira Death. So, he can, atta he can attack here. But if this is what I think it is, which is a... um. Excalibur or it's now I don't know once once he once they play but I'm Dial I mean Palkia yeah it's pretty much gonna be a um oh a basic ball interesting so he can pull another one out another one of her yeah I was gonna say he's probably gonna pull another one of her out that way he can um play um he can get a rare candy next turn. So, nice setup. Yep, pretty smart, pretty smart. Um, here, unfortunately, his Palkia. Oh, wait, what's your basic? Oh, Stadium. Okay, good. Exactly what we wanted to see. We need a rare candy. Okay, good. And we'll go ahead and pull out Swamper. Hopefully, we need to pull out. Alright, good. And so we need to put some damage so we can knock out the Palkia. Excellent. Oh, I forgot. We're electric, so this... We actually didn't even need the uh, extra 250. The extra 100, I mean, but yeah. Good start. What we really want to see now is boss order or so. Well, that would be ideal here. Three or is this the? No, that's the second one. She they pulled out last turn. Okay, so pretty. I mean, nothing much here. We did, we actually got a really decent hand. Was able to set up by turn two. Um. See, so yeah, a really respectable here. And we're we're even good. We got lumen. Luminous energy, so we can even, which I, I was expecting this to come out. So this is Sheena Powell. I, I'm not 100 percent sure on that name. Back Back Scalibur, That's how you say it. Back Scalibur. So it's gonna retreat here. Obviously, this was. Pretty obvious of play, but he's not gonna be able to do too much damage here. Let me see, what's that three? I mean, maybe enough. So let's see, let's see how many he pulls out of his hand. Because if his hand's full of energy and he has like no way of hitting us after this, well, we really have no way of touching him either. So it's kind of Okay, two, and we know he retreated with one. I think he's just going to 60. He would need six to Oko me here, I think. Yeah, six times six is 36. So he only has three, which I figured he only had three. And he, he gave up all three, too, so his...
funny enough to how you guys remember earlier how I was just saying can we can't take another 180 but I don't think he can hit us again hard right now so yeah let's go ahead and oops Pupitar here. Of course, we got rid of our Swamper once we get another energy, but it's fine. Because we're in no real rush to get Swamper right now. So, we attack here. Then we'll heal next turn if possible. Which we should, because he should need another turn. He should. It should take him like two more turns to set up. And if not... Yeah, we have boss order too, so... This is our target next turn, so... No need to even heal up here. You would think this was a really great deck, but it um it's just it's just doing its job today. That's that's about it. Oh, I for, well, yeah, we could have, we could have, to, to insult to injury, we could have went ahead and healed ourselves, swapped them out, um, you know, yeah, we, <laughs> we could have looked real dangerous there if we wanted to. So yeah, that, it played, that played out really well, like I said, it doesn't, that worked really well against one of the best decks out there right now, is that Backscalibur deck, so really, really nice to see. Um, but two two things about them, and yeah, they, they I mean they use two. Uh, how do you say her name? Iridis, Iridis, right? They used two, had two Iridis, which basically is the trump card for that Backscalibur deck. Once you if you if you get two of those, you pretty much can set up consecutively, and it's pretty hard to compete with. So, um, but he he had two of those, still wasn't able to really, like fully set up. Uh, he was only able to do 180 to us the entire game, I think. And so once we once we had got steam, we was we was rolling. Yep, it was unfortunate for him because we took out his Palkia and stuff early. Um, I would like to normally throw out Mudkip. Mudkip takes so much setup though that I've realized now it's. No point in putting Mudkip out first. Just the setup's too much. Another another very popular deck, and I'm I'm really like super low, so I run into the same old same old decks, and that's that's where it's not as fun. I think I think when I get higher, or to a higher point, that's when it, like decks like the one I'm using now, this Tyranitar becomes more, it, it feels better. I think going against these these powerful basic decks, I think um, constantly doesn't help much. But I could be wrong. Maybe these are. Maybe people are using these decks in the um Masters League or so. Um Yeah. 
I'm gonna go ahead and get Greninja out here, I think. That's all we can do. And he can go crazy next turn, I think, already, so. Oh, wait, okay, yeah, good. We already have another Pupitar already, so. Insert your deck for a card. Okay, yeah, so we're. Yeah, psh. <laughs> he hits us, we're good. It's the only time right hand is like really useful. I, I, I see it. I see just how like, useful he really is in this deck. I might need to add more of him because, and I might need to add a sacrificial pawn, um, as well. So good, he got rid of Boss Order and Garatina VX. That's crazy. He wants to have another one already in hand. So us getting hit right now is exactly what we want. Ooh, that's annoying. That's annoying. If he goes for both Lavatars, that would suck. Let's see, wait, what is he doing? Let's see. Hopefully he's an idiot and doesn't go for both Lavatars. And he, he's no slouch, I'll tell you that. So he made the right call. Let me look at you, one of your discard piles. Oh, it, it has to be from the discard, so never mind. That wasn't going to work too well anyway towards the energy. So. Is it because I don't have a... Mm. Yeah, we weren't going to be able to do anything last turn anyway, I don't think. Because we didn't have any energy, so, in the in the discard. So, that's kind of a negative on his part, not being able to play him. But that explains why we um, leave some... It, 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 the deck, it, it, a lot of things are starting to make sense the more I use it, but... 
still very hard to um, completely uh, use. So he's looking like he's running low on his deck's getting thin, but we're going to probably help him out real soon with that. Unfortunately, so rare. I have it's. I haven't seen anyone lose or haven't beat anyone from like like losing all their cards and since like my very first early matches where I actually used to run out of cards, not realizing you that that was a, a thing. So Kramer Mock. Okay, never mind. He's gonna do that whole switchy thing for a while. The reason this deck works is this, they gotta have like two, they gotta have like four escape ropes, four switch carts, four switch items. I mean, it, it's the only way. And then he, you know, for sure has like boss order in the, in his hand right now. So, Say about the last card we wanted to see right now. And he already has 10. So right now he could be do some devastating damage. Mainly he'll just try to take out my mud kip, I'm assuming. Let's hope we get the uh, desired hand here. not holding back this game funny thing too about this deck is that they he, he can keep drawing honestly so we're like Greninja's like our final hope here which we're we're good to go I think this yeah so. we're out of like draw options this is any card right including energy okay so if it's including energy, then we're good. We're good. This is all I can do for now. Oh, God.
Well, I would have went for the juggernaut there and went for two KO kills. Oh, okay, wait, what's this? Ah. Uh. Yeah, I like the backbone of this deck. I really do. I really do. It's just it just isn't consistent. And I I can see a few ways to fix it. I think a, a lot of times All right, here's what I'm going to do. We're gonna duplicate this. I have never really done a duplicate duplication. But a few things need to come out of here. One that's one, two. Um I actually do like you, but you might need to come out. We might need to add a, another one of you. Now, Swamper isn't that important, but important enough. I should probably add one more of you. You can come out, Cynthia. You can come out. Switch Rare Candies. Ultra Ball. You can come out. I've not... Not the biggest fan of Ultra Balls at, at any capacity. So we'll keep. But I feel like it's no point in having VIP passes if you're not going to run. If you're not going to run. Um, Ultra Balls. Because you can't. You, usually. You, like they're just free discards for your Ultra Balls. Once like after turn one. But if you're not using Ultra Balls, then they become dead weight. So I think they come out. And I think we go back up on the. Um, so a few things. I like this thing. But it's, it's not that great, but I, I do like it. You're an item, right? So that's an item. Rare candy is an item. And the basic ball is an item so that that gives me a good reason to get Ervin, arvin um or maybe not i'm not sure we don't have any tools here or should we get should we get some tools We'll think about adding some um, tools. So I think um, Jack needs to come in here. And I was going to say just two clavels because we already have uh, the net balls. So two of these. We need some energy retrieval, I want to say. Oh, also we need, uh, what's your name? Where's the one that gives you the uh, energy? Is this her, right? Yes, yeah, sir. 
four four basic energies we're gonna put them in here so I honestly think we need two of you. We'll remove one Lavatar. I don't think we need two of you. Especially in early end games, she doesn't get, she's not that very helpful. Also debating if we really need four jacks, but they, boy, it's so great when you need one and you pull one. So I'll leave it. Well, there is a lot of inner loop here because we have her. Then we also have Jack, but she does help. We get this, get that. She's actually a better. She might be better than Averin, honestly, because we don't have we don't want to waste adding tools. Yeah, I think we just do two. We just do four of her instead. Of, yes, at, at, at worst we get a tool out of her. I think, um, which is we just want. To, I mean, an item card. We get an item card out of her, which may just be our um, rare candy or something. Also, we can yeah, switch too. So, also this pump thing. So yeah, she's she's a lot better, I think. Here. Also, I think I want to see the girl that grabs the discarded. Clear, I think I want her. Yes, Sid. Like I said earlier, I think if like two it if like two of these is better than Well, no, since we added what's her name, I think, I think it would actually be better to, um, do two, two, two waters. All right, so. We made the adjustments. Don't want to make this video too, too long, but I, I think it's important to go ahead and, and see if we can see an immediate result. We've already seen, I think, two games, right? I already showed. So, yeah. I like the skeleton. I like I like the... I like... I, and I, I forget constantly Swamper's ability, but Swamper hardly ever gets out. But remember, guys, with this deck, too, and, and it's so rare because the em em energy is limited here on this deck. So, I think we want to go second since we are using kind of Clavel here, but... Honestly, don't think it matters too much. Hopefully we see who we need to see in this redraw. We do not, but it's fine. So been a good start hand for my kid, but it's okay, it's okay.
surprised to pull this much energy. <laughs> Funny, oddly enough, so. Okay, perfectly fine with me. Well, actually, not really, because I need it. I want to keep that rare candy. But, you know, if we get what's her name, oh, we still didn't get her. So, if we get the, well, we do get jacked up, but we don't get the rare candy anymore. So, what's the point? Still asleep, I think, on tills. Not what I want to see. I should have switched out that turn, actually. Yep. 
Let's start some prison things. What are, okay, so what are my two options here? I can't hit him for two fifty. Yeah, I think we I think we'll go with that option. Okay. It's a big loop around, but and only for us to pull energy too. Oh, we still hung on. That's crazy. I mean, really, at this point. My hand has not been too kind, even with the uh, the changes. All right, she is she's what we needed to see, that's for sure. Nice, nice. Okay. I don't really think there's anything to gain. Yeah, I guess we did need maybe one Ultra Bowl. 
one or two ultra balls, I think. Would have been. Oh, he couldn't even finish us. Aren't you? Yeah, he gives us two. That's interesting. And there's the water for next turn, so that's interesting. Yeah, uh, oh. I keep forgetting about the fact that we can um, attach, like, energy. Uh, there's, like, two per turn for... Yeah, we were set up pretty nicely there, so... I think that's game, though. So I don't know if he wasn't paying attention or what. I would have subbed out. I know he probably had better options there. So once again, I, I keep forgetting about Swamper. He he's so in the back of my mind. But the thing with the interesting thing with getting him out is if you can set him and Tyranitar up on the same turn, you can double into Tyranitar to get him his energy he needs. So I think I, I kind of like this deck a little bit better. I think. I'm going to need a few more sample games to like really see, like, okay, we really need to add this card in here because we always seem to have this constant problem of this. So there's going to be definitely some, like, me making adjustments. But so far, the deck, I think, felt a little bit better after we made some initial adjustments. Um, but, yeah, here's the deck um, that we are currently going with. I think... What just sucks is if, if if Tar for Tyranitar his Lightning Rampage, if that was a fighting in a normal, then I would feel a little bit comfortable throwing in like a jet, a jet um energy in here. But it's no one on a team that would benefit from that. Um, yeah. So, anyways, like I said, I hope you guys did enjoy, it, man. Real diversity. We are out. Hit that like and subscribe. We'll be back with more. Um, Pokemon TCG as well as uh, Marvel Snap if you guys are into that game as well. So, peace out.